In this video, I'm going to share with you why tilde is a great way to build your website. And I want to focus on three reasons for now. First is the gorgeous templates. So the tilde templates that come standard are really quite elegant, quite nice. You'll see some in a few minutes. A lot of other free web site builders are out there and I find that Tilda just has the nicest pre-existing templates. The second thing is that it's super simple. You get these blocks to use and I'll show you what those look like to create a website. It makes it really really easy and quick to drag and drop things into your site, to add things, to turn them off, to move them around. And then thirdly you can export everything. So if for some reason you want to move to a different platform or you decide to uh, to just back up everything in some other way, you can export everything you have on Tilda site um, as long as you have a, a paid version of Tilda. So with that in mind, let me show you a little bit of what Tilda looks like. Uh, and the first thing I want to show you are some of the templates. And you can see here there's a variety of different kinds of templates. Um, these are blog or content templates. You could use them for a micro story, so one big project, a big piece of content, a trip journal, a particular article you're excited about. Uh, a top 10 list. You could use it for anything like that. If you have a big event, there are some great templates for events as well. It could be a webinar, it could be some sort of online conference, and basically you could just take the existing template, modify the pictures and the text, and you've got something ready to go. You can take payments and reservations directly through here. There's a variety of different styles if you want a more drawing focus style, if you want to include the agenda and speakers, um, all of that is possible with these templates. There are obviously templates for commercial stuff as well, um, for portfolios. You can create a simple personal landing page. If you want a simple landing page site for yourself or your project or your organization, you can do that. So lots of really great templates. And uh, I want to show you some examples. These are some examples of things people have built on Tilda that are really quite elegant. Um, this one I thought was pretty cool because it's just a puppet theater <laughs> little product that's kind of interesting. Here's someone who's made uh, a portfolio using Tilda with beautiful visuals. There's text in there as well, but it's mainly visuals. So you can create really great Tilda sites. There are great templates. Let me show you a little bit of what it looks like when you're actually creating something. So I'm on the create new page section. I already have a website that I've begun and I'm just going to start with a blank page. You could start with a template which is great but I just want to show you what it feels like when you're starting with a blank page. You basically can choose any of these blocks and I'm going to choose a cover block for the top of the page and maybe I don't like this particular style so I'm going to go up here and scan through all the other different kinds of covers I could choose and just for the sake of the demo I'm just going to pick one quickly and um, I'm going to replace the text with something for something I'm working on if I wanted to. Um, um, and I'm going to potentially and I can change it anytime I want. I can change the text, I can add a background image, I can change the spacing and the padding by going in here under settings. Pretty easy to operate. I can change the content here or I can even just type it in right here. Um, and uh, this is a site I'm building about children's books actually. So. That's why I'm using this kind of content. Now I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna choose something else, another kind of block. Let's say I want just a phrase or a quote in here, um, a quick um, section break with a great quote. Now I want a gallery of some images um, and this could be any kind of gallery that you see fit and it's easy to replace the images and there's a lot of different kinds of galleries, sliders, before and after sliders full screen image slideshows. There's all kinds of galleries you can use. I'm going to also want to list some features, let's say, of a website, of a group, of a project. Um, so there's a bunch of different options. I really like this one um, for features because I can alternate some text and images. 
and I can keep on going and add all kinds of other elements. So I can embed forms for people to sign up for a newsletter or for your mailing list or really anything you want uh, for a meeting. I use it to uh, let people schedule little brief meetings with me um, because I can plug it into my Calendly calendar. Um, you can add your contact info easily and drop that in. And basically within a few minutes you've got a page structure made with these a variety of kind of like Lego blocks building together um, toward a, a nice site with Tilda. So just to review, Tilda is a great website building tool. It has super nice templates. and allows you to export things. It's not completely free. Um, you can use it free to start out. If you want to have uh, a full set of all the, the resources, it's 10 bucks a month. I actually make multiple websites with it, so I pay 20 bucks a month, which I think is totally reasonable given that these are professional tools that you're using for investing in your career and your creative work. So with that, I highly recommend Tilda and encourage you to, uh, to give it a try and it's tilde.cc. You might hear a lot about uh, Squarespace and Wix and Weebly and Jimdo and so many other things, right? And 36% of the web is built on WordPress. But I encourage you to check out Tilde, even though it's not as widely known. It's a, it's a really great tool and I think you'll, you'll enjoy it.